Hi, I'm Danielle and this is Liz. We're from Emu Campers and today we're going to show you how to put up our Explorer 15 foot tent. So first of all, we need to take the black cover off. We've got six tie downs on the cover. Stop the wind from getting underneath it. So we undo the six, there's three on the front and three on the back. which Liz will get to in a moment. So once the tie downs are undone, the cover is Velcro and zipped. So we undo the Velcro all the way around. This cover has two zips, which makes it easier. So they unzip and unclip from one end. So what you want to do is you want to roll the cover so it becomes nice and neat. And it's easy to put into the toolbox at the front. So we roll it up. Pop it in the front toolbox so it doesn't get all wet if it rains or if it does rain and your camper dries out, then the cover's not wet afterwards. So we get our ground cover tarp. The reason for a ground cover tarp is to ensure that if you go camping, if you go camping and the uh, ground is slightly muddy or it's in the cooler months of the year, the dew doesn't get underneath the tent. Plus if it does rain, once you put the tent up and pack it back down, we, you won't get mud on the actual bottom of the camper. So what we want to do is one person either side, you want to grab the bottom of the, now this is the furthest point to the trailer. Sorry, the closest point to the trailer. You want to pull that down. Then you want to get the furthest point of the floor and pull. Pull as far as it'll go. It won't be very far to start with. What you want to do is this trailer's got what's called an easy erect system. So if you just give a little nudge of the poles, you'll see that it starts to pop up. Push on the, the framework you can see that it's standing there by itself and it's slowly erecting itself. Give it a little bit of help. You'll see that it's all sucked in. That's because of the vacuum of the canvas. So just a little pointer on the canvas. We use 15.2 ounce canvas, which is the thickest on the market. It's a tight weave. It's made to ADR. Des Australian design rules. It will keep you dry, but don't forget that these are still just a tent, a canvas tent. They're not a caravan with fiberglass walls. It's still a canvas, so if you get stuck in torrential rain for a few days, eventually it will start to leak, but not straight away. Let the camper breathe a little bit and it will fall into place. So once the camp is at this stage, we grab the corner of the floor and pull it out as far as it can. And what you want to do is you want to make sure that the wall that's up against the trailer is nice and flat and even to the trailer. So when you peg it down and you taut out the floor, you know that it's gonna be all lined up nice and straight and it's gonna be not flapping in the wind. So open up your, uh, your flies, step into the camper. So what you need to do is you've got two, two poles 
that you need to erect to open up the doorways. So you push them open to as far as they go. So you don't need to over tighten them, but you do want them as far as they will go so that you can proportion the tent out properly and there's no sagging. So step two is undoing the pole for the roof. Tightening up that pole. Inside, we have two poles on the inside which are attached by Velcro. This Velcro needs to come undone to allow the legs to flip down into the corners. Like so. And you extend the pole down to the floor and your tent is about 80% up. The next step is to push out the back wall poles until they clip in. Make sure that your walls are nice and straight. Grab your rope for your fly or your ozone roof and you peg it down. That's how you put up the Emu Campers 15 foot explorer tent. Okay, so just a little tip and, tip and trick from us at Emu. When you're rolling up your windows, what you can do is you undo the zips, attach the Velcro, and you fold it in half, fold it in half again, and again, and then roll at the end, and you're up. Ta-da! Ta-da!